I, today I actually wanted to bring you a review of this Hourglass Film Noir Lash Lock Curtain. And I've been using this pretty religiously. Um, and this is kind of like a different product. This is definitely something very, very new. So you guys can see it's like this and it's like flat and then it goes like this. Um, it's actually pretty spiffy and the way I see this, you basically put this over mascara. So when you have lip gloss for a lipstick, like you put lip gloss, I'm going to scoot back. Um, so when you have like lip gloss over a lipstick, this is like lip gloss for your lashes. Like you put this over mascara and I'll show you guys, it comes out like this and it looks kind of like a little nail brush, like a little nail paint brush. And as you guys can see, it comes out the blackest of black. But the idea about this product is that it's going to give your lashes glossy shine, which like a lip gloss, it gives it glossy shine instead of just a mattified look. Um, overall, if you know how to use this product right, it is amazing. I personally love it. Now, if you use this product the wrong way, you will get very, very spidery lashes, which is good if you want them, but if you don't, then it's pretty difficult. Um, the only thing I don't like about this product is that it is difficult to apply. How this basically works is that it comes out like this, and you're supposed to get it on your lashes. Now, if you go like this and close them, then it's great. You can get it right on the lashes. It'll go on perfectly. You like how I like matched my eyes to my outfit. Anyways, it'll go on like pretty much perfectly and you just kind of stripe it on and it gives your lashes like this gorgeous black tint. Now here's the thing. Sometimes you end up stabbing and then it like gets all over your um, eye area. In that case, it kind of ruins your look. Not too good. Also, um, it can be very hard and scary to see yourself, you know, stabbing at yourself with something. Now, if you go back and forth like this, as you guys can see, the lashes are starting to clump. So if you go back and forth like this, you will end up getting a very, very spindly spider lash look. And that's totally fine if you like the spindly spider lash look. Um, but if you don't, then, you know, it's, it's not a good fit. But if you go like this, then that's fine. It won't give you those spindly lashes. So it really depends on how you apply it. Now, it can be tricky because it takes a lot of of tips and tricks and I'm not sure what the retail value of this is um, you guys can see it sets pretty fast though like look at that like it's not gonna come off um, I don't know if it's waterproof or not but whatevs it is film nor lash liquor I'm actually pretty pleased with this product like I said you have to learn how to apply it correctly you have to know how to apply it um, you can apply it if you're not wearing mascara it's best over mascara um, I personally don't care for it without mascara um, just because it gets very, very spindly and like you see it doesn't pick up all of the lashes correctly. Um, hmm. See, that's, that's not too successful right there. But overall, I feel like it is a generally pretty good product. Um, like I said, you just have to learn how to use it. Now, I can't remember the exact retail price. It was in my Sephora haul, which probably, I don't know if I said the price or not. Um, you can get it at Hourglass, at Sephora, you name it. Um, here's the thing. Is it worth it? I honestly really, I personally do like this. I would pay for this. Now, if you're the kind of person you already have the perfect mascara, it works for you, you don't need it, go ahead and stay away. Um, if you are the person who likes to have, like, the option of spidery lashes versus really long glossy lashes, then this would be the thing for you. So is this product a necessity? No, it's not. You can totally make an amazing look without it. But it's kind of one of those things just to add razzle-dazzle to kind of your overall makeup makeup look. Um, so that's just my review. It's very short because I know you guys don't like long videos and I'm going to do like an email time talk which will be exciting. Um, but I hope that you guys kind of know a little bit more about this now. Like I said, it's basically lip gloss like to, for your lashes. That's all it is. Um, I'm pretty pleased with it. You really have to go in and try it out. If you go in into Sephora, they will let you try it, which is nice. Um, but let me know what you guys think if you have it. Do you like it or do you hate it? Let me know if you guys have tried it. Did you like it or did you hate it? Um, let me know your overall review. And if you have a review, then post a video response. That's just what I think of it. Um, that's kind of how it works for me. Hope you guys found this helpful, and I'll talk to you on the next video. Love you guys. Bye.